Oh, oh, oh. We're playing Life is Strange Before the Storm Episode 3. <sighs> Play <coughs> someday. Eye or face twitching, jerking, or shaking of arms or legs. I hope I don't have a seizure. That'd be. <laughs> Square Enix. Up for Triangle Enix? Circle Enix is for a close second. I know! Hell is empty. Oh, start an episode. I'm not stupid! Previously, <coughs> on Life is Strange Before the Storm. I felt like my dad's been lying about something. For yeah, that woman's your mom. I didn't know what it was. There is plenty of blame to go around. What does that mean? You forced my hand. You have a this hand? Is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. We both agree that the best thing for everyone at this stage is for me to move in. In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. Hey! Blackwell's Black done with me. I can't go on anymore. Is this junkyard all I've got left? Drew runs Oxy for Damon. Go to Drew's room, find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Whatever you do, don't open the door. Oh, I want my fucking money! Juliet is wailing. That infernal inferno is the culprit, closing down the roads and robbing us of our aerial. No fucking chance. Oh yeah, I forgot I acted. I swear to thee, we shall fly beyond this island. The corners of the world are mere problems. I think most of us remember from the last episode the, the, the mom reveal and the kiss. Yes. Let's leave. For real. <clears throat> if you don't mean this, it's it's just making me feel like shit that this life you're describing isn't is going to happen? happen. What would it take to convince you? Wow. Why can't you just tell me the fucking truth? Rachel, that woman you saw, that wasn't my mistress. Was it? Huh? That was your mother. She says that was your mother, so weird. I want to tell you all of it. But are you sure that turn the Chloe volume down a little bit. be here for... Chloe stays. Of course. Okay. In every way that matters, Rose is my wife and your mother. But the woman you saw at the Overlook, her name is Sarah. What do I know that? Your <coughs> birth mother. He says birth weird. Your birth mother. I'm going to tell you everything, Rachel. Everything. I've shielded you from for so long. But shielded? Can be There's a shield instead of sheltered. Is this really something you're ready for? Yeah. I want to know. <laughs> oh, your finger's going through it. Chloe. I'm right here. Good. I need you. Okay. Turn into graffiti. I know how to do that. I go around it. So we like graffiti it.
They're looking through. What's up, you? When I was in high school, there was one person everyone adored. Her teachers, her friends. Sarah was everyone's favorite. Every boy wanted to date her. I could barely believe it. And she picked me. Sometimes, I don't know where the teachers like her. Me blind for so long. <coughs> she was so alive, so passionate about everything. Early on, though, I realized I wasn't enough for her. while the rest of us were pursuing college, careers, families. Sarah wasn't looking for any of that. She was looking for escape. When Sarah became pregnant, thought it would solve everything, and it did, for a little while. Becoming your father was the greatest moment of my life. There was so much love, but I was still blind. What's next? Descent? However much she loved you then, Enough. For Sarah, the need to escape was always there. For over a year, I tried to help her. I made myself believe that she was still a good person. That no matter what happened, She would never do anything to hurt you. I was wrong. Eventually, I saw her for who she really was. A destructive person. Someone who could never be satisfied. Anyone or anything, even the love of her own daughter. I was desperate. I didn't know what to do. So I made a choice. I was never going to let her harm you again. Reunion. But you saw <coughs> at the Overlook, Rachel. <coughs> it was true, we kissed. It was the saddest kiss of my life. It was a kiss goodbye. I told her, and I was happy for her. And she felt like she'd gotten her life together, finally. But she didn't get to just decide one day to be a mother. Not after what she'd done. Not after all the people she hurt. All the lives she destroyed. I told her she'd been given the greatest gift in the world. The chance to be your mother. And she squandered it. Pained me to hurt her like that. 
but I'd do it again and again and again to keep you safe. I'm just surprised he brought out like a viewfinder so they could <laughs> disappear. So that was the first time you've seen her or spoken with her in 15 years? No. I send her money every single month. It's all our arrangement. But now, she wants to see me? Yes. But Rachel, it cannot be. You think you have the right to decide that for her? When I left Sarah, when I took Rachel away, I truly believe I saved her life. And I will continue to protect her no matter what. But maybe she's different now. I mean, people change, right? Maybe so. But consider that for 15 years, she's preferred that money to you. Rachel. I think I need to lie down. Rube. <coughs> Juliet. She seriously just shut I up. can't leave Rachel to deal with this alone. The Tempest show feels so f this is so painful to look at. Honestly, I need to talk to them, but... Okay, so at least they... They put on the fire! <laughs> Surprisingly, though, there was none. I was so certain the fire would start. <clears throat> hey, Mrs. Amber. I think it's Rose at this point, considering everything. Okay, Rose. Sorry that tonight turned out so uh, differently. That's all right. I'm really quite glad that you're here. Thanks, but why? While Rachel's dealing with all of this, it's a relief to know she can talk to you. How are you doing, Chloe? How am you I doing? You just switch to that line real quick. She loves to talk about how awkward different things are. <clears throat> well, this must be pretty awkward, I'd imagine. Nah. It's fine. Rachel's the one who's really upset. She has every reason to be. Okay. There are many painful things about Rachel's past, including my own role in hiding the truth. Sarah shouldn't have taken money over seeing her daughter. You know, I am so thankful to her that she did. 
It gave me the opportunity to be Rachel's mother. I never knew how much I could love someone until I had Rachel. But hearing the truth after all these years hurt Rachel more than anything. I'm not happy with James for the whole way this came out. You're not happy with James? What about what he did at the Overlook? It might be hard for you to understand, but after 13 years of marriage, I'm not threatened by what happened. You're right. I don't understand. You don't have to worry about me or James. Rachel's the one who needs you right now. Do you think Sarah is dangerous? I've never met her, so I don't know. But I'm inclined to trust my husband. His entire life is about keeping people safe. Rachel's extremely fortunate to have him as her father. <sighs> Thanks. Thank you, Chloe. James, I'm talking to you. Um, this must be hard for you, too, Mr. Amber. Can I call you James? It could be far worse. <clears throat> My biggest fear is that Rachel will try to meet Sarah. I've dreaded it. So that's why you never told her? You have no idea what pain Sarah's caused. Her addiction has led her to do terrible things. I don't want Rachel to go through any of that. I, I don't understand. Are you afraid that Sarah would do something to Rachel? I don't think she would deliberately harm anyone. But addicts can cause tremendous harm without meaning to. Yeah. Rachel's not a baby anymore. Listen to me. Sarah brought criminals and drug dealers into our home. She put Rachel in serious danger just to chase her habit. Do you think Sarah is involved with any of the drug dealers around here? It wouldn't surprise me if she were. That's who she is. Chloe, I believe Rachel trusts you more than anyone else right now. Is this where you ask me to manipulate Rachel into doing what you want? This is where I ask you to do as your conscience dictates. But please, put my daughter's safety first. That is something I will always do. She's so young. You are too. But I know you've experienced loss. Protect her from that. Please. I'll do what I can. I care about her too. You yeah. Know? I know. Thank you. Am I gonna go upstairs to see, uh... Rachel? Can I go upstairs to see Rachel? Oh, I can! Could I, have, could I have done that from the whole beginning? Could I have done that last episode? <coughs> Dog, no, do or do. Squire in Alex. It's not Squire, it's Square! I am so happy! Let's travel. Deck nine. Oh, I love a whatever kind of computer that is. It looks like a Mac. Uh, Rachel. I 
I better not be I able to graffiti anything. I need some way to show Rachel that I'm here for her. Makes sense that Rachel needs two signs to contain her awesomeness. I should, Rachel's surrounded by so much love, yet she seems so... Hello. Rachel even knows how to make a dinky lamp look cool. Rachel has so many inspirations, she can barely keep them all contained. Robert Chu. The ying and badass yang of Rachel Amber. We were so close to making our break last night. Now... Is there a section on how to walk fours through batshit crazy family drama? I need to turn the volume no. down. Shit. I could get grades like this. I just don't want to. You found it's too low. First aid kit. Um. <coughs> Mom, geez, she can't. Ugh. Oh, look, I can graffiti. I think Rachel could use another subject. But which one? Anatomy. Extra credit. That's the one. Show and tell. <laughs> I know something Miss Arcadia doesn't. Weird. Even you, Lily, couldn't come up with the tragedy Rachel's going through. Um, Rachel's really into stars. I wonder if it's her way of feeling connected. Oh, I can take these flowers. <laughs> At least she'll have something from tonight. Another graffiti? Maybe I can make the world a less scary place. On stage, I think Rachel said. American graffiti. Heard that Rachel and Nathan hang out sometimes, but it still seems hard to believe. So there's like one more thing I'll do. Turn this on. This light needs more light. Well, that's why I have the flashlight. Wonder what I could find around here to brighten up that night light. Come on, you can do it. All ready for Rachel's light show. Better get her attention first.
Okay, check it out. It's beautiful. I thought you might like it. I've always loved stars. My, they remind us there's so much beauty out there, which we almost never see. Maybe. Because we're blinded by what's in front of us. <laughs> exactly. But then I learned the truth. The stars we're seeing have already been dead for millions of years. They're all lies. That doesn't make them any less beautiful, right? I don't know. If they're not even real, then what's the point? They were real. It's all lies. Everything. My entire life. My dad. My mom. Oh no. If I can even call her that anymore. And that other woman, my real mom, she's the biggest lie of all. I can't trust any of them. I think you're the only one in the world I can trust. Take it, even if it's only by process of elimination. Okay. I wore this bracelet my entire life. I never even asked why. Never even thought about it. Somehow, I think I always knew. Even when I didn't know. That my real mother was gone. Dude, I'm gonna listen to this. What to happen? Hey, it's a map. The stars? Hey, it's Chloe! Okay. The fact that she's here right now, that she came here for me, I think I need to see her. Is that wrong? I don't know. Honestly, I have no idea what's right or wrong in this situation. I just know that whatever you decide, I'm in. But what if we can't find her? It's not like I can ask my dad. I have no idea where to start. I think I know what to do. I'll call Frank and get him to connect us to her. You do that, we'll give it a shot. Of course, even if we know where she is, we need a way to get to her. I can't just ask my parents for a ride. I 
think I might be able to fix up that truck in the junkyard. <laughs> really? I'll give it my best. I know you will. But even if you find her, how will I talk to her? Stop asking me these questions! After my dad died, I didn't know how to keep talking to him. I still don't. But it doesn't matter. All that matters is that he's there. Your dad? In my dreams. He's there. It's so real. It's almost like it's another part of my life. What's about it to happen? used to be the only part that mattered. I've never told anyone about that. Weird, huh? Uh, Rachel? I was just thinking... Maybe I was wrong before. <laughs> Who cares if the stars are dead? As long as we can still see them, that means they're real. To us. Right? Yes, so. Right. What's next? <gasps> A bird! And I'm naughty. Stars. the graffiti Glane hey Chloe sends us a bird and they're on the stage driving hey look there's David and mom and principal and Chloe and Rachel's parents Jesus that plane Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, it's the birds to work on cars together. Those are some of my favorite memories. She went switching to David. You mean my memories? I don't think you remember after your dad. Touche. It's about to happen. All right, you win. Why don't you go take a look? Sure. It's about to happen. Improv. Well, they got their sound effect people are amazing. <laughs> or are they doing it themselves? <clears throat> well, that hood seems awfully close. What's wrong? Don't you see anything? Fine. It's... It's a spark plug. No, that's not it. I just had that replaced. Isn't improv supposed to be all about yes and? Yes and what? Dad, stop. None of this is real. You're not real. Rachel's family isn't real. This whole thing, it's, it's all just theater. Well, you know what William Shakespeare said. Something about the whole world 
being a stage. So might as well act the fuck out of it. Maybe. Nailed it. I don't think she exactly nailed it, but... Maybe there's a reason we pretend. Maybe the lies we tell each other are less horrible than the truths we keep hidden. Bob. That's pretty dark, Dad. Where do you think you get it from? There's my cue. Dad? Relax, sweetie. It's all pretend. Right. Just a bit of stage magic. Floodlights, sound effects. Chloe, look at me. Look at me, sweetheart. It's going to be okay. Jeez. Blood. Oh no! Jesus Christ, I'm surprised, but. <laughs> Damn, Heckler! Oh, it's funny. Okay, I saw Sarah leaving Frank's RV. You might know how to find her. Yeah. He might also be totally pissed about Damon's money. I've got to get this exactly right. Okay. I can do this. Frank, eager much? Where's the money? Chill, I've got it. Jeez, would you relax? I have it with me, okay? I'm coming to get it right now. I have a favor to ask you. You can't be fucking serious. I need to find that woman from yesterday. Sarah. Frank? What the hell for? Something important. Can you help? I'm trying to help a friend. It would mean a whole lot to her. The girl with you at the mill? Yeah. You're a real. That went well, I guess. So you need like tools to fix the car. I'm pretty sure Navi car needs gas. Into? Tap. Do a lot better. Guess what? I'm a good kisser. <laughs> yes, I am. Okay. I've got two hours to kill. A shower would be fucking amazing. Figures. Um, what? Nice to see my work is appreciated. <laughs> Rachel really is good at everything she does. <laughs> Thou art an idiot.
<laughs> At least she's smart and she's like quit right away. Oh, I need to plug in my computer. Games take a lot. You just drain battery. Wow. Okay. Shut up, computer, I can tell. There we go. Woo! I guess it has been 42-ish minutes. Okay. Back. There's gotta be graffiti. Yes, another breaking. Can change my clothes? No. Nope. Yep. S water. Uh, better than nothing. I think your first problem here is that it's not in your window. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not good for your plant. Just another brick in the wall. Death on the man! Mm -hmm. That's right, David. Huh. Tab Victoria. You see here, her little sidekick now. Yep. I had it with the school. Nobody gives a shit about me last night. It was all Rachel, Rachel, Rachel. Fuck you, Chloe. Well, that's rude. Jeez. I have a, some new messages. Who's Justin? Back. Wells. Stop talking. Why are there alerts? Elliot. Back. Jeez, I'm lagging. Ugh. So, if I put this photo out, Mom just hides it in a different drawer? What the hell? Graffiti, yay! Sports cars are really good for... Hitting on chips. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. She got rid of the ring. No way. Mom actually sold her ring for three hundred dollars. Shit. David really is moving in. Ugh. David. But I thought, I think it's pretty obvious by in the new bags, but. Any receipts? Is that David's towel? Where the hell is mine? Well, who knows? Okay. I'm getting like new glasses today. Here somewhere. I should just 
Come or a new earpiece. Where's mine? Fucking broke. Wow, that was fast. Can't believe Max and I were so into this shit when we were kids. Wait a minute. Captain Bluebeard's hair dye. Max was going to make me a pirate, but we never got around to it. Yeah. You used that I hair dye. For the best shower of my life. Hot water. Don't let me down. Gross. David shit. I Razor. truly hate seeing so much of David shit around here. Shower, shower, shower. Your legs look so broken there for <laughs> <coughs> Wait, what the heck is that blue part? In your hair, what the hell is that? Hey, what the heck? Yeah, wait, I know you can't see what I'm pointing at. No, did she try dyeing her hair? Just like really fucking fail that? Oh, wait. Okay, here we go. Okay, new clothing. I'm not gonna be hot dog man, I'm not gonna do Illuminati. New clothes. Oh, is this how we normally see Chloe? <clears throat> what do I feel like wondering on this easy ass thing? Uh, I'll do bonus outfits actually. Um, Punk Do Deluxe. Duh. Done the other two. You Punk Do. Alright. One last thing. I need to get Dad's tools so I can fix that truck. Dad's toolbox should be in the garage downstairs. Change my clothes again. But I can't wear her dad's jacket. Get on demand. David's fist is going. Wax. Here goes. What are the chances I can avoid mom or David? I don't know. What are the chances you can avoid mom or David? <laughs> bird, fly, fly, bird. <laughs> <laughs> I'm flipping them over. Not yet. I told you three minutes each side. They're gonna burn. Oh, you're the expert now. I can't stand it. I'm telling you, it'll make a mess. <laughs> you know, you don't have to make me breakfast. I mean, they can see the Chloe from that you angle. Cook I'm just all the time. I want you to have a break at home. <laughs> you are one class act, David Madsen. <clears throat> Mom actually looks pretty happy right now.
Hey, who's there? Hey, Chloe, your hair. When did you, was this for the play? I heard you performed last night. No, I mean, I, I did, but this is, uh, this is something different. None of that matters now. Oh, I am so glad to see you. I'm also glad you came home, Chloe. I'm... I'm not staying long. Just... <laughs> picking up some stuff. Oh. Are you coming home tonight? Mom, I... I don't know. I wish you would tell me what you're up to. I'm... I'm just hanging out with Rachel. Oh! How is Rachel? I was telling David about the play and you being in it. I really gotta go. Listen, wait. Before you go, David has something to say to you. It won't take but a minute. Won't take but a minute? I just want all these new clothes! Oh. All punky and like awesome and shit. My blue hair! Chloe. <clears throat> I. Uh, I don't have time for this. Now, hold on a minute. Please. I. owe you an apology. Now, David's not a bad guy. Chloe. Let's hear it. <sighs> Chloe. I should not have asked you to empty your pockets yesterday. I was uh, out of line, and I'm sorry. Okay. Apology accepted. Really? Yeah. Good job. And good job, Mom, for twisting his arm or whatever. Chloe. What? It's great. He listens to you. Can we be done now? Wait. One second. Don't go, Chloe. I've been... meaning to show you something. Maybe... Maybe now's a good time. This is my friend Phil Becker. We served in the same unit, two tours. Becker was killed near the end of our deployment. Roadside IED. Yeah. We used to joke about all the trouble we were gonna get into once we got back home. But he died. He died and I didn't. And I think about that fact every damn day. The point is, I've had my share of grief. I know what you're going through. So I guess what I'm saying is, I'm here to do what, whatever I can to help you get over the loss of your dad. Please, I'm begging you, give David a chance, won't you? Here, why don't you keep this photo for a little while? Think about what I've said. Sorry. 
<laughs> he was not a bad guy. He <laughs> looks so young. He look. He looks young. He looks. Young. He looks like this. Actually, this model, he looks kind of like a, a J. Jonah Jameson. Like a young J. Jonah Jameson. <laughs> we get back. <laughs> Thank you, David. Oh, um, Where'd you come from? That I'm voice. So proud of you both. Mom, I really need to go. Be careful out there, Chloe. I love you, sweetheart. I need your feet. All right. All right. What's next? What's next for a young hero? There's got to be graffits in what here. Graffits, graffits. Not graffiti. Not graffiti, just graffits. Ugh. Just gotta grab Dad's toolbox and then get out of here quick. Holy crap. This might actually be helpful for fixing up the truck. Cool. Never mind. No graffiti. Huh. I was wrong. There was no graffiti there. The fuck was that? Little line. <laughs> like some speedy bird. Jump off the train. Squirrel. Work with me here. Yeah, her hands are all. Damn it! Fuck! Better. But still needs a bit more love. I can salvage this beast. I just need to find the right tool for each problem. Jeez, I'm gonna fix a duh. It's not like I need a manual. But I'm really glad it's here. Subiator cap. Um Music. The distributor cap looks pretty gross. I need something small to scrape the gunk off the cap. Okay. So a screwdriver? That should help keep shit distributed. Whoa! Well, fuck. Go Alert back system. From once you came. Okay. Oh, David. Does she talk about the kiss? Oh. 
Okay. <laughs> cool. Okay. Check. This connection is pretty shaky. Ah, uh, the pliers. I could fix this battery post if I could get a good enough grip on it. Another wrench. I don't know what I'm thinking. Gotta check all these. This thing seems pretty gunked up. Ah, screwdriver again. I think I should move on to something else. Yes. Itchy. It's pretty loose. How can I tighten it? <clears throat> I don't know anything about tools. <laughs> oh, it's a screwdriver. Yeah. Nothing doing. No, okay. <laughs> I did think it was. What's going to happen? I'm just checking everything, seeing what needs to happen. This thing is going to fuck up. Blow? Maybe. You. Sick. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to use like an air hose to do that. Oh, I can graffiti. Hmm. What do I see? Um, Raven. <laughs> I know. Raven's the best team Titan, so I like. Fuck yeah, I have to. That's just probably going to ruin the marker. <laughs> oh, that's, that's kind of kind of cool. Okay, intake cube. Intake cube? What the fuck am I saying? It looks like someone tried to patch this thing up sometime before I was born. At this point, I think that ancient duct tape is better than anything I can do. Better leave it be. Cool. Okay. I can definitely see some problems. Yeah, it's the wrong button. I don't know if the pliers are good here. I think they are. The wrench is for the middle thing. I don't know what it was. Belt something? Uh, something yeah. belt? Thing. Fits like a deadly, deadly electric, electric glove. glove. Wrench. It's a socket wrench. Anything else? Uh, much better. Spark plugs busted. Carbon deposits. Of course. She needs her dad's. Ew. Only you can prevent forest fires. Please. I need you. She did she replace a gas?
Yeah. What's about to happen next? Yes. Woo! <laughs> Fuck yeah! Change clothes again? Feedy? Hey! Junkyard Queen! Where are you at? Hey! Holy shit! Your hair! It's so... <laughs> badass? <laughs> I was gonna say hot. <laughs> but, yeah. Badass too. Hey! Not sure if you saw, but someone moved your truck. No way. Should we check it out? <laughs> Frank should be here soon. Hey, Price. Nice wheels. You're early, Frank. What's the occasion? It's his fucking bar mitzvah. Frank here's becoming a man. Aren't you, big guy? What's he doing here? What do you think? We're not dealing with a couple of dime bags anymore, Chloe. Where's the money? Here. It's right here. Obviously, I was going to give it to you. You don't have to be such a dick about it. You heard what happened to Drew, right? Maybe try keeping that in mind when you talk to me. Dude, your eyes. Rachel, don't, don't fucking touch her. Why is it that chicks think it's okay to hit me? What if I lay a single finger on them? Suddenly, it's a whole other thing. Frank says you were asking about a client of his. Is that true? Yeah, it's true. I don't see why you should give a shit. You don't. Maybe I'll show you. See? You two Nancy Drews decided it would be a good idea to call your drug dealer and ask about his business. I didn't go to a fancy academy, but that doesn't strike me as smart. Maybe it was this man's sunny disposition that can I mean, It'd be very you simple to just hold them. Yeah, it's Rachel's mom. Side to him that I don't think you'd like. Should we let them see? We're just talking here. Okay, then let's talk. I want to know right now why you give a shit about this woman. She's a friend, an old family friend. <laughs> this chick doesn't have any family or any friends. Look. None of this matters. 
All we care about is that you stop asking questions. Got it? Rachel, you need to ask them. No. Tell me where she is now, Rachel. Wait a minute. <laughs> no way. What the fuck is your problem? Rachel? As in Rachel Amber? <laughs> that makes so much sense. This is okay. James Amber's fucking kid. Yes, but Damn it's also it. Sarah's. Your dad's a real piece of shit. You know. We know. You're aware. Not sure what that has to do with us. Me neither. But I'd like to find out. Here's what happens next. Come on, okay, man. We know he doesn't kill they're her. Just kids. No, they're not. <coughs> this one is the fucking DA's daughter. And right now, she's going to fill me in on what her daddy is up to and how he's connected to that whore everyone's asking about. Damon, calm down. We're still talking. Damon's the only one here who can possibly cool. be killed. No need to get crazy. <laughs> Ooh, Rachel! Ugh, fucking bitch! It'd be super simple if everyone would just talk. Oh no! Except we know this doesn't kill Rachel. Because Rachel's killed later by, uh... Rachel! What the fuck? Chloe! Go! Now! Oh, it only went through the arm. I thought it went to, into her. Hold on. Shit. 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 